Hi, Ian Willis here from Wilson's Estate Agency and we're here to wrap the month that was in May of 2019 on Real Estate and Peninsula. First off, let's have a look at the three major suburbs and how they performed for the month. Something you won't hear me say very often, but the best performed sale in the suburb for the month was actually Woi with 20 sales for the month and an average price at $703,000, so really strong there in Woi. Your minor beach, a lot more sales, 30 sales, but an average price around $603,000, so $100,000 cheaper. And Edelong Beach, seven sales, an average price around $607,500. Taking a look back at a feature sale from last month, it was a property at number 64, Woi Road, Woi. This actually went to auction and had a bidder's guide of $475,000. It was sold on the day with competitive bidding from two bidders at $492,000. So a couple of key points to that. Number one, the auction method brought about a great result within four weeks of selling, uh, of marketing, when at the moment, the average days on market is a lot longer. And the second thing was we had a really realistic bidder's guide, which gave a bit of, um, uh, clarity to buyers on where it might be on the day, and actually obviously went above that, uh, so you know, we're really happy with that. Average listing for the month, we've actually got three of them because they're all in the same complex. It's a brand new uh, development at 117 Lawson Road, comprises of three uh, three bedroom properties. There's one townhouse and two single level, level villas, easy for me to say, but they vary in size and also between single and double garages. But you're looking there at price ranges around the 650 to 700 thousand dollar mark, close to the waterfront, waterway CBD, and train station. So if you're looking for an investment or a downsize, it could be a really good option for you. Um, lastly, obviously in May we had the election. We talked a little bit about that beforehand on uh, potential of Labor getting in. If you're smart enough to put money on Liberal at about five dollars to one, congratulations. What we have seen though is since Liberal was uh, re-elected, it has given a bit of stability to the market. Buyers were expecting the prices were going to continue to get cheaper and willing to sit on their hands. Even in the two or three weeks since that's happened, we've seen a lot more stability and confidence back in the market. But maybe we have seen the bottom out of prices and then we might see some stabilisation now. So if you're looking at buying a property, there's no reason now to hold off. It looks like the market is where it is. It's foreseen the future. And if you're looking at selling a property, there is still a good opportunity there to capitalise on this market because there are buyers now keen to buy and uh, understand what's going to happen. If you've got any further questions, uh, you know how to find me, email us from Wilson's Estate Agency. I look forward to seeing you again next month.